Hi, in this short video, I'm going to show you how to set up a data drift alert that will notify us when there is a mismatch in number of columns between source files being ingested. To demonstrate, I've created a pipeline to migrate data from local file system to S3. And here's what I've set up the data drift rule. of type size, which refers to number of fields. I'm going to go ahead and activate it. For the sake of this short video, I've limited the number of files to two. As you can see, file one has four columns, whereas file two only has three columns. Now let's run the pipeline and see what happens. Okay, so the pipeline has run successfully, and here's the alert notification. Let's also confirm that the files or the data was migrated to S3. Now, there are a couple of things I'd like to highlight before I sign off. There are other types of alerts that you can set up, like changes in field names, field order, or their data types. And you can also set up webhooks to receive alerts as text or Slack messages. And they can also be delivered via email. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.